Well, aloha, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is Master Paul. Very happy to be connecting with you today. It's Monday, January 15, Martin Luther King Day here in America. And it's been a full weekend, a busy weekend, but I'm glad to be back with you here today. Thank you, Kristen, for reminding me that um, I needed to make a posting for today. I had quite a few responsibilities I was taking care of. <clears throat> and uh, so when I checked in as to what should be the topic matter for today, it was actually to teach something from Master Shah's books. And so I went to his books today and I found a beautiful piece of information on brain and brain health and uh, secret and sacred codes to strengthen brain and brain health. So that's what we're going to be focusing on today for all those <clears throat> that are just tuning in or just tuning in for the first time. So if you'd like a way to balance the left and right hemisphere, if you'd like a way to increase your intelligence, decrease headaches, decrease uh, uh, mind tension, brain tension, de-stress, this is what can assist you. So uh, this actually is listed in, in uh, several of Master Shah's earlier books. It was some information that was given to him from by his spiritual father, which I'll explain more as we go. <clears throat> so how was your weekend? Uh, hopefully it was good and valuable. Uh, most recently this weekend here in Honolulu, uh, we had a very unusual scare. We had uh, woke up in the morning, here it was in the morning, 8 a.m. Uh, at 8.13 a.m. there flashed on everyone's telephone. If any, anybody had a smartphone, they saw it. And it said, uh, imminent missile threat, go for cover. <laughs> and, and I'm just rubbing the sleep out of my eyes and it says, imminent missile threat, go for cover. So I had to see, well, when exactly did I get this warning? And have I been sleeping a half hour through it? Uh, am I gonna die today? And so um, it gave me an opportunity to apply the wisdom of Master Shah as a um, spiritual teacher and a uh, dedicated servant to humanity and requires me to be present exactly for these kinds of conditions. One thing that Master Shah has been stating for years now is that humanity is going through some significant shift and some significant change. Uh, we've seen that with tidal waves, hurricanes, tsunamis, and more. <clears throat> and um, war is no different than any of these other possible threats. What is relevant is how do we respond to these kinds of things. And so what I witnessed, um, not, not with my eyes, but based on after the fact, was a lot of people had a great amount of fear. A lot of people had a great amount of apprehension and they didn't have a, a path or a solution. What do you do, you know, if a missile's eminently going to land on top of your head? Uh, there's only one place to run if you have that ability, which is in an underground scenario. And I don't think anybody was prepared for that except maybe the military. So it was an interesting thing to witness, to observe. Myself, how I responded, I was like, well, I looked out the window to see if anybody was running around scared. Didn't see that. I looked at my wife who was still sleeping. I said, well, do I really want to wake her and cause her stress when we don't know if this is authentic or not? If a bomb does land on her head, <clears throat> probably better that she's asleep than, up, than awake in great fear. And um, so I decided to just let her sleep for a little while. And I decided I, that I would check with Heaven's guidance. And I said, Heaven, what should I do? And they said, go turn on the news, see what's going on. So I said, okay, I turned on the news. And the news said, whoops, we made a mistake. It's not really a missile. Uh, sorry about that, we pushed the wrong button. Now the rabbit hole goes very deep on pushing the wrong button because there's no, <laughs> it's almost impossible to make an accident of that nature. But uh, regardless, the key is the response. And so if we are given opportunity in the future as students of Master Shah, as someone who is practicing soul, we need to be there to serve others. We need to be there to keep others calm, to keep others relaxed and in a place where they're not freaking out and harming other people because they're freaking out. We're all going to leave this planet at the appropriate time for our soul and its journey. So why in the world would we be spending any additional time freaking out about that? 
better to be in a place of love and peace and harmony and to be the calm one in the room and be the one that is assisting everybody to be as organized and calm as possible so that uh, no or as, as few lives are lost as possible. Um, so it was an interesting experience. So I thought I'd share that with you. So thank you all for coming. Thank you for joining. Let's see who's joined us today. Welcome Lisa Bellavance. Aloha Kathy Arnold. Aloha also to Francis Robinson. Robertson. Welcome Jennifer. And aloha Donna Brandt. Welcome Rianne. Aloha Steve. And Giotta, welcome. Aloha Vanessa. Welcome Janice Crosby. Welcome Kim Morrison and Larry Gassendonner. Welcome also to Neil and Kristen Strachan. Welcome Paula. Aloha Jim. And welcome also to uh, Heather. Welcome to Kristen Rojas. Thank you for your service, Kristen. And Aloha Crystal Dawn. Aloha Paul Black. And welcome to Roshan. And welcome Jocelyn. Welcome Erica. Welcome Tiffany. Uh, uh, let's see who am I missing. Welcome Shelly. And welcome Donta. Aloha also to Christina and Sheila Nelson. And welcome to Di Merritt. And welcome Terry Ferguson, Master Terry. Welcome also to Nina. <coughs> and welcome Atena. Welcome also to uh, Angie. M.A. Drade, aloha. Welcome Allison, aloha to Judy Ung. And welcome to Sharon Dodd, Christine Lewis, welcome. And welcome Larissa. Uh, Elizabeth Carrasco, welcome. Uh, aloha also to Bob Reed and Sandra Kavanaugh. Lily ba Rob. Welcome, Crystal Valencia. Aloha, Pat. And I think I've got everyone. Welcome also to Lotzia Rimmer. <clears throat> so thank you. If I missed your name, please forgive me. Let us connect, and then we'll move straight into today's teaching, Wisdom and Blessing. We place our hands in soul light, soul service, hand connection. Drop our left hand in front of our heart center, gently keeping our right hand pointed towards heaven. Let's close our eyes, fully connect. Dear our beloved Divine Creator, all layers of the Divine Tao and the Source, our individual heavens, teams, guides, angels, and saints, dear all the Buddhas and Bodhisattvas, Lamas, Sifas, Gurus, saints, angels, healing angels, and archangels, beloved Jesus and Mother Mary, beloved Namo Amitofu, Lingue Shangshur, Kuan Yin, Medicine Buddha, Happy Buddha, uh, Krishna, Ganesha, all the beings of light, including the light side, planet, stars, galaxies, and universes, and beloved Mother Earth, we love you all, honor you all, deeply respect you all, and ask for your presence today in whatever way is most appropriate. We ask that as <clears throat> we go through any of the practice wisdom and guidance on these practices, that you assist us to clear our Shen Qijing blockages today, especially for our brain. Please, as appropriate, bless each and every one of us to clear the blockages that might inhibit us from having balanced left and right hemisphere and having balanced uh, intelligence. Very, very grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And aloha and welcome to Don Brown as well. <clears throat> so dear the source, soul song of love, peace and harmony transmitted to all souls in all universes. Love you, honor you, respect you. Please turn on. We invite all souls in all universes to chant with us. At this time, let us offer our unconditional service for anybody new watching for the first time. This is a mantra. It is a healing tool. And Kristen Rojas is an awesome universal servant. She usually posts in her chat boxes the, where you can access this song for free, download it, and play it 24-7. So let us chant to serve and connect heart to heart, soul to soul. <coughs> Lu la lu la li Lu la lu la la li Lu la lu la li lu la Lu la ha li lu la Lu la li lu la Wo ai wo xian er ling Wo ai tran ran ling Long ling rong er mu shir shang Xiang ai ping on er xie 
，相爱平安和谐。I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. How how how! Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thanks for coming. Thank you for hitting the share button and letting other people know about these live streams. Always grateful for your sharing. Okay, getting a couple calls during the live stream. I have to decline them. <coughs> Early on, when Facebook first started doing their live streams, it was a blessing. Of course, it's 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 a free way to serve. But they had a lot of hiccups, like when a phone call would come in, it would literally just knock off the live stream. <clears throat> so I had quite a few uh, uh, early day struggles. But Facebook uh, live stream has done a great job. Thank you, Facebook live stream. So today, what are the sacred and secrets to balancing your brain, to bringing healing to your brain? My teacher, Dr. and Master Zhigong Sha, uh, takes no credit for any of the blessings, the wisdom, the miracles. He always gives credit to Source. One of the reasons why is he has a very good teacher. His teacher's name is Master Guo, Master Chichen Guo. Master Guo in China was a very well-known um, doctor of traditional Chinese medicine and a doctor of acupuncture. And he had a clinic over there where in the course of one year, he would see 200,000 people in the course of a year. Uh, and that's that's you know quite a few a month if you do the math on that and so when you're seeing 2,000 people a month you got to be pretty good this is one person and his five kids and his wife uh, of course he had some staff to help out but it wasn't a hospital it was a um, a clinic grounds and where people stayed and they would come in <clears throat> and he would check spiritually the blockages and he would offer blessings spiritually and then he would also um, narrow down the combination of what they needed with f typically four or five herbs now if you talk to an herbologist most of them use uh, quite a few more than that and but master guo was known as the man who cured the incurable uh, and he would look at people's tongues he would check spiritual guidance uh, write down the the herbal prescription and then he had a team there on his commissary that would make an herbal concoction with the two, three, or four herbs that he suggested. And he would have an exceedingly high rate of people with irreversible diseases with them reversing. So yes, a good chunk of it was the herbs, but many people also have blockages related to their karmic uh, conditions. And if those karmic conditions are too high, well, you know, it's time for them to pass on. But he would also use his spiritual blessings. Now, because he was very spiritually connected um, uh, with the source, he would receive every night, this is according to what Master Shah said, every night since the age of nine, Master Guo would get woken up. And he would have his, he, he would say, God would shake his toe. That's how Master Shah would repeat it. God would shake his toe. And so he would wake up and he would go over to a typewriter because this is 40, 50 years ago when that's what they had, those typewriters. And um, <clears throat> uh, he would uh, type out the messages he was hearing from heaven. Now this is Master Shah's teacher, Master Guo. So when I tell you Master Shah talks to heaven also, you have to understand, so did his teacher, right? This is when he was nine years old. That's when he... He literally was became enlightened as a nine-year-old um, and so he had many years of talking with the divine well the divine gave him what's called a sacred number code he gave it to master guo and I'll, I'll share that with you today now it's in this book uh, the first book that it was printed in is this one called power healing and this is a master Shah book but he gives credit to his teacher master guo because he didn't receive the number quote his teacher did some of you might be familiar with the San San Jolu Baya Wu number code, which helps to release your soul language. And it's, it's a mantra that when chanted can actually bring healing to others. So that number code was also received by, by Master Guo. And one of these days I'll do another training on that. I've done that a couple of times, but uh, there's always new people come in. So about once every four to six months I'll repeat. But um, 
You can learn more on that if you want to go to either of these books, Power Healing, or this book here called Soul Mind Body Medicine. Now, I recognize it's opposite in your screen, but Soul Mind Body Medicine is what it's called. And so in here, he talks about the sacred number code for the left and right brain. Thank you, Kristen, for posting the link to Soul Masters. It's a movie in which you get to uh, uh, see a documentary of Master Shah and his spiritual teacher, Master Guo, in China. Wonderful 90-minute documentary, well worth the five bucks. Hope you go to see it. Uh, let's see who else has joined us here. Welcome um, to Greg Fischel. Uh, welcome also to Sheila Nelson. Welcome Karen White. And welcome also to Lisa Patterson and Monica Hoffling. Welcome also to Tally Ayers. Thank you all for joining. Thank you for sharing. Uh, so, Master Shah first heard this information when he was in, welcome Robert Dosa, when he was in um, China training with Master Guo. Master Shah was, I believe, 21 or 22 years old when he started training with Master Guo. And uh, it was right after he had graduated from uh, a university uh, at, uh, with an American medical doctorate okay, in American medicine. <clears throat> and he started training with Master Guo. And then he went back and got his education in higher education in um, uh, traditional Chinese medicine as well as an acupuncturist. He's a very well educated man. Um, but the key with Master Shah's wisdom and Master Guo's wisdom is the spiritual soul connection. Because everything is soul. When you heal the soul first, the mind and body follows. So the key is to deal with everything at the level of soul. So when we connect at the level of soul, welcome Quincy, great to have you here. When we connect uh, at the level of soul, then everything that happens uh, below it has to transform and this is for some of the newer people coming in uh, you have a soul your brain has a soul we're dealing with the brain today everything has a soul because everything is made of creator everything has energy and matter creator created energy and matter therefore everything has soul and uh, soul is the carrier of message light side and dark side so all the good things we've done is carried at the level of soul and all the not so wonderful things we've done is also carried at the level of soul. So if at some point in time we have harmed other people's brains by offering them uh, very unpleasant information, traumatic information, if our ancestors uh, in the back in the warring times maybe um, were using uh, instruments of destruction and, and, and hurting people's heads, Obviously, this is a kind of karma that's kind of hard to, to ignore, right? So these come back and they uh, are reflected at the level of soul. So that might look like, for those of you wondering what that might look like, at the level of soul, it might look like a dark cloud on the soul. The soul is a nice white being, but in the brain area might be a little darkness, a dark cloud, right? That's a representative of karma. How does it look down here on Earth? Well, it looks like, it feels like, uh, fogginess in the brain, the inability to put numbers together, uh, different labels have been given, mental difficulties, um, dyslexia, uh, uh, schizophrenia. There's a lot of different names for mind-related blockages, and some of those go very deep into the karmas. Uh, and then there's, there's simply the inability to remember, uh, memory issues, etc. All of these have roots in karma. They have roots in and negative energies um, where we and or our ancestors had made some mistakes wrong thoughts wrong words wrong actions upon others and so they they stay as a form of a message a negative message on our soul and they impact us in our life so when we do blessings and do activities to uh, transform those blockages at the level of origin then at the level of physicality where we are now it has no choice but to change how do I know this well I, I didn't become a master accidentally. I witnessed this 10 years ago when I witnessed Master Shah doing special blessings and he would explain what I'm telling you, that he's not blessing the person's sore back, he's blessing their soul. He's removing the negative messages at the level of soul. Therefore, their back at the physical level is responding. And it took a couple years to grasp it to where I just, ah, oh, I get it, okay? So everything that Master Shah teaches truly makes a lot of sense. It's the application of it that helps us to validate it. So now I'm going to read from uh, the first of the two books, Power Healing, to give you a little insight, okay? This is, again, the Power Healing book. 
This is on page uh, 114, 113, excuse me, and I'll read from this book. Brain research explains that there are about 15 billion brain cells in our brains. We now know there's quite a few more than that. 10% um, of them are used. The unused 90% of the brain cells are called potential brain cells. How to develop the potential cells of the brain is one of the essential issues for brain research. Awakening and developing the potential power of the dormant 90% of brain cells should be a goal for every person to develop his or her mind power. There are two parts of the brain. The left brain is in charge of the logical thinking, uh, language systems, regular non-creative thinking, mathematical analysis, planning, organizing, and, and, and uh, analysis of structure and statistics. Ugh, just thinking about all that makes my brain hurt. But some people, that's, that's what they're excellent at. Other people are very right brain. Right brain is in charge of creative capabilities, inspiration, creative visualization, and function of the third eye. These functions include analysis and summarization of the messages, images, pictures, and field phenomena. Messages can be received in your brain in the form of pictures, images, words, or feelings. Developing right brain capabilities includes developing the third eye, the seat of the ability to receive messages in the form of images. Okay, so in order to, to translate the message that comes with the image, we must work with the balancing of the left and the right hemispheres. A number of codes can help you develop both sides of the brain. As we discussed earlier, Natural number sounds and other healing sounds can vibrate the internal organs. And we discussed that earlier when we were talking about San San Jo Liu Bai Wu. Or many of you in Master Shah's teaching, you hear the word Jo, 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 Jo. Jo is a uh, um, sound power and it also reflects number nine. So in the Mandarin Chinese language, it's actually number nine. San San Jo Liu Bai Wu translates to three, three, uh, uh, 339 uh, Those are numbers, right? San San Jo Liu Bai Wu. San San Jo Jo. That's the number nine. And we will use that number in our practices for um, uh, boosting power to the lower abdomen. So a number can actually impact special parts of the body. Number nine is related to the lower part of the body. Okay? The yi, 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 that's the number one. That's related to the upper part up here in the, in, the, in the head. Okay, Every number corresponds to a different area of the body. And so when we use the number code san san jo liu bai ya wu, which we're not doing today, then it has very, very unique properties. The ability to offer healing to others, the ability to help open us up and release blockages. Uh, I can go on and on about its properties and abilities, but not today. Today we're going to focus on a different number code. And all of this information, again, is in, in both Master Shah's books, Soul Mind Body Medicine and um, Power Healing. So, <clears throat> number codes can help you develop both sides of the brain. Welcome, Master Elizabeth, and welcome, Sasha, and welcome, Eva Karif. <clears throat> As we discussed earlier, natural number sounds and other healing sounds can vibrate the internal organs. Different healing sounds vibrate different organs or areas of the body. The founder of uh, Jinung Medicine, Master Guo, has developed a set of new mantras composed of number codes to vibrate and develop the left brain, the right brain, and the tissue in between. This is very important. There is that space in between. Those who have epilepsy, what do they do when they go in and they do surgery? Do you know what they do when they do surgery on people with epilepsy? They go in and they snip some of the nerves between the left and the right hemisphere. That's what they do. And then it solves some of their epileptic problems. Now, it probably is diminishing their brain functionality as well, but 
it solves some of their problems. Soul healing can also solve these problems. I know, I've witnessed it, and have offered blessings that have literally reversed the condition of epilepsy. Thank you, Heaven Dowen Source. Again, I'm not doing it. Always give credit to Heaven. But these things are resolvable. But it's interesting because left hemisphere, right hemisphere have to communicate, and ideally in balance. And so this number code balances all three areas. That's what makes it very, very unique. Yes, Lisa, Corpus Colossum. Thank you. And welcome, Carl. And welcome also to Alfred Sidney. Welcome, Becky Lafave. Welcome, uh, Richard Amodio. Uh, welcome, Rose Marie. Okay. So what are these number codes? To develop the left brain, now Kristen uh, uh, Rojas, keep an eye on her chat. She's going to post another number codes, okay? The number code to develop the left brain is 908. Now, if you chant it in English, it may have some effect, but according to what Master Shah shares, is that it has to do with the vibration of the mantra. And it was received by an individual who was Mandarin Chinese, by his teacher, Master Guo. Therefore, it has a frequency associated with that language. So we chant it in the Mandarin Chinese language because of the frequency associated with that language. All right? So 908 is Jo, remember number nine? Jo Ling Ba. Repeat. Jo Ling Ba. Jo Ling Ba. Jo Ling Ba. Jo Ling Ba. Very good. To develop the right brain, the number code is longer. 92244 is the English number code. And it translates to Jo R R S S. Because 9, 2, 2, 4, 4, you're repeating those, right? Jo, again, Jo, R, R, S, S. Jo, R, R, S, S. You can also develop the potential power and capabilities of the left and right side of your brain at the same time. Between the left side and the right side is a tissue called the corpus callosum. The number code for the center, the corpus callosum, is 01777. Welcome, Dan Martino. Uh, welcome also to uh, Carol Struckendine and Camille. And if I missed anyone, forgive me. And so Kristen has uh, posted, and she's pinned it to the top. So just go to the top of all the chats, and you'll see uh, the number codes. So now you know there's three separate number codes. What we're going to do is chant it again and again and again and again and again and again until it becomes second nature, and you don't have to memorize it. Okay? If you want to stimulate the left brain and the right brain at the same time, then you chant the pattern for that. If you want to chant the left brain and the right brain and the corpus callosum, which is the ideal mantra, then that's what you would do, is chant all three. And I will give you that in a moment. Why does this work? The left brain belongs to the yang side. The right brain belongs to the yin, yin side. Chanting the number code for the yin side, 01777, uh, excuse me, uh, vibrates the tissues between the left and the right. Chanting the number code 908 vibrates the left. Chanting the number code 92244 vibrates the right. The more you repeat, the more you vibrate, stimulate, and develop each side. Now remember, each number also is vibrating an area of the body. So that means that the brain's connectivity, whenever you hit on the number nine, for example, it's vibrating aspects of the lower abdomen that are connected to the brain. So it has been said that the brain controls everything in the body. It has been said that the second brain is the uh, abdominal area, your intestines actually. So everything is interconnected. When we are doing this, yes, we are definitely firing up left and right hemispheres and corpus callosum, and yes, we're absolutely clearing blockages, but we are also stimulating all of the organs and systems. We are balancing the yin and the yang. So the yin is the right 
hemisphere, the yang is the left hemisphere. What does the left side of your brain control? The right side of your body. What does the right side of your brain control? The left side of your body. Okay. Those who have stroke, for example, this is an ideal mantra for them. Rebuilds their brain, balances left, right side again. Okay. If they have stroke on the left side of their body, they'll want to bring more power to the right hemisphere and so forth. All right. So let us chant this together. <coughs> We're going to start by doing the mantra Ling Yao Chi Chi Chi. This is Corpus Clausum right down the middle. Repeat. Ling Yao Chi Chi Chi. Again. Ling Yao Chi Chi Chi. Ling is the number zero. Zero one seven seven seven. Ling Yao Chi Chi Chi. Repeat. Ling Yao Chi Chi Chi. 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 Good. Jo Ling Ba. That's uh, Jo number nine. Ling number zero. Ba number eight. Jo Ling Ba. Jo Ling Ba. Jo Ling Ba. Now we're left side of the brain. Okay. Jo Ling Ba is left hemisphere. So put it together. Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Again Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba very good. So what are we doing with this? Ling Yao Chi Chi Chi, center of the brain, Jo Ling Ba, left side, center of the brain, left side, center of the brain, left side. We're causing them to communicate well. Now we're going to uh, bring power to the right side. So we say Ling Yao Chi 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 again. We start with the center and go to the right. So the right side is Jo R R S S S S. It's like a S with a I U. Tsu, 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 tsu. So, jo, uh, Ling Yao Chi Chi Chi. Jo R R Tsu Tsu. 9 2 4 4. Jo R R Tsu Again, slowly. Ling Yao Chi Chi Chi. Jo R R S S Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R S S Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R S S Good. So this combination is doing first the left side, then the right side, and the corpus callosum in the middle is going. Zzzz. I have talked to teachers who have taught their students this in the classroom <clears throat> and the kids absolutely love it. They just love, 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 love it. And they have tested this, uh, to do this prior to testing, prior to anything where the children need to remember stuff. And the results have been wonderful. Okay, So you can do this as a way to wake up your brain in the morning. You can do this for that... Um, that grandma or that person that is showing signs of Alzheimer's. You can do this for that person that has stroke. You can do this for your children. Highly recommend this for your children every day. Okay, kids, while they're eating, well, not while they're eating, they're going to spit all over the table, but at a time when their mouth is not full and they're doing something uh, like getting their clothes on or packing or whatever it might be for school, Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R S S. If you make it a game with the kids, they will love to do it, and they will actually ingrain it in their head. So they'll be at school and they don't even be thinking about it. And they'll be repeating it, but what's it doing? It's helping them and their intelligence. As Master Shaw and Master Guo put it, it's waking up 
dormant cells in the brain. We on average only use about 10% of our entire capability. So this is a sacred and secret code to awaken those dormant cells. Not a small thing. Thank you, Master Guo. Thank you, Master Shah. Thank you, Creator, for giving this information to them. Okay? So let's do it together now. So, <clears throat> ideally, we want to do this with our eyes closed, not looking at the numbers. Okay? And you'll catch on. Don't worry about that. We'll just keep repeating. <clears throat> We're going to uh, follow the four power technique and forgiveness practice as always before we do the practice. For power technique helps us get the most value out of the practice. Uh, forgiveness practice releases the sum of the negativity that resides in the brain. Okay, so let's do this together. We start by placing our hands in soul light, soul service hand position. Left hand in front of the heart center, right hand gently remain pointing towards heaven. It's like a prayer position, but we just drop the left hand in front of the heart. It's a hand mudra position that connects heaven into your heart center. Okay. <clears throat> Close your eyes. And if it is comfortable, please repeat after me. Dear my beloved divine creator, my name is Paul Fletcher, Paul Fletcher, Paul Fletcher. I wish to sincerely apologize if in this or any lifetime I or my ancestors have brought harm or suffering to any souls anywhere in time. If I or my ancestors have created mental or emotional trauma that has impacted people's brains and thinking processes. If I or my ancestors have introduced into their lives toxins uh, that has tainted their water or food supply that will have that could have harmed their brains. If I or my ancestors have done anything physically to harm people's heads or their brains. If we have done anything at all to harm any souls, we ask most humbly for forgiveness from all of the souls that we may have harmed. Please forgive us. <coughs> Continue. Dear all of the souls that may have brought harm or suffering to me, including trauma, poisoning my food or water, or hitting me in the head, auto accidents, etc. I offer you all my unconditional forgiveness and release you of any debt that you may have to me. Thank you. And now we do the four powers. So relax your palms over your lower abdomen. You can envision that in your head the light is dancing around between the left and the right hemispheres. If, however, this causes you to feel a little lightheaded, then immediately bring your thoughts down into your lower abdomen. Ideally, we keep gentle thought on the brain and the majority of our thought on the lower abdomen because the mantra creates the results regardless. We don't ever want to put too much focus in any one area, especially in the upper part of our body. We already have, as a human race, too much focus in this part of the body, and it's, it's actually hurting us. So this will help to bring balance. Okay. So most of your focus in your lower abdomen, gentle focus in your brain area. And let us start by doing the left brain first. Very slowly, repeat. Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba 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 Ling Yao Chi 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 
九零八，零幺七七七，九零八。Now we're going to go a little faster and just observe gentle observation of more、uh, excitement and activity in the left brain. Go a little faster this time. 零幺七七七，九零八，零幺七七七，九零八，零幺七七七，九零八，零幺七七七，九零八，零幺七七七，九零八，零幺七七七，九零八，零幺七七七，九零八，零幺七七七，九零八。零幺七七七，九零八。零幺七七七，九零八。Okay, relax. Did you run out of breath? <coughs> Remember to breathe. Let us do the right brain. 零幺七七七，九二二四四。Let us begin. 零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。Little faster. 零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。Feel the right brain. 零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。Little faster。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。零幺七七七，九二二四四。Okay, how does the right side of your brain feel? Notice any difference? When you open your eyes, is it a little brighter? Go ahead and close your eyes again. Now we're going to do center, corpus callosum, left brain, center, right brain. We're going to do center, left brain, center, right brain, center, left brain, center, right brain. It goes like this: Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ling ba. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ar ar si si. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ling ba. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ar ar si si. Okay. So do your best. <coughs> Keep your eyes closed. Keep the majority of your thoughts in your lower abdomen. Just watch and observe the dance of sparks in your brain. Let us begin. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ar ar si. Excuse me. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ling ba. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ar ar si si. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ling ba. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ar ar si si. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ling ba. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ar ar si si. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ling ba. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ar ar si si. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ling ba. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ar ar si si. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ling ba. Ling yao chi chi chi, jo ar ar si si. 
three more times and then we'll speed up. Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T You guys got it yet? Oh, you want a little bit more? Okay, six more, and then we speed up. Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T Last one Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T And now let us go a little faster. You can do it. Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R T T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R S T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R S T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R S T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R S T Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo Ling Ba Ling Yao Chi 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 Jo R R S T And now, for those that are really interested in seeing what they can do, let us do it very fast. Ready? Ling yao chi 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 jo ling ba ling yao chi 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 jo er si si. Ling yao chi 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 jo ling ba ling yao chi 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 jo er si si. Ling yao chi 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 jo ling ba ling yao chi 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 jo er si si. Ling yao chi 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 jo ling ba ling yao chi 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 jo er si si. Ling yao chi 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 jo ling ba ling yao chi 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 jo er si si. Ling yao chi 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 jo ling ba ling yao chi 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 jo er si si. Ling yao chi 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 jo ling ba ling yao chi 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 jo er si si. Ling yao chi 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 jo ling ba ling yao chi 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 jo er si si. Ling yao chi 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 jo ling ba ling yao chi 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 jo er si si. Ha. How do you feel? Happy, giggly? I see. People are having fun with it. Good. So this is something that you can absolutely do with your children every day and have fun with it. Actually, it is taught that the faster you go, the better the results. So you play with the the children. You play with the adults. Those that need this, including yourself. Do it faster, faster, faster. What's it doing when you're doing faster, faster, faster? <laughs> Waking up the left and right side, balancing that corpus callosum. It is a very good caffeine. But I have had about seven years of practice on you, so it makes it a little bit easier. And yes, feeling hot is normal. It is something that comes with the territory. Of vibrating your organs and systems, because remember, every number is vibrating a different part of the body. Ling yao chi 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 jo ling ba ling yao chi 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 jo or zuzu, just the whole body going zuzu. So you are getting body healing, you are getting brain healing. It is a very very powerful mantra, and we wish to thank Master Guo and Master Sha for bringing it to humanity, for being the receptor of this wisdom from heaven. So yeah, very very powerful. And let's see. Welcome, Monica. Welcome, Ilona. I know you guys have been here a while, but I'm just seeing your names. Welcome, Joanne. <coughs> and welcome, Julio. Welcome, Jermaine. And Aloha, Emma. Welcome, uh, Anjali. 
and welcome Holly and Aloha also too <coughs> say I miss anybody here probably welcome Tara Lila Lila and Sheila Nelson and Sharon Dodd says that was lovely she apologized she had the giggles and she sat on her bed with 30 year old daughter in here miss the opposite side in her headphones and we had fun trying to keep up welcome Danelle so uh, and welcome also to Henry so the mantra actually carries huge power it truly does and the if there was a downside with any of Master Shah's teachings it's that there are so many of them it's hard to choose which ones to put your focus upon and so when I teach classes and I'll do a uh, I'll do a, a calling at this point in time. If any of you are interested in opening your spiritual channels, clearing health-related blockages, all in a period of 12 weeks, you do want to join my Awakened Spiritual Channels because it, it's a natural side effect that you clear a lot of your health-related and emotional, mental-related blockages, as well as open your spiritual channels in my 12-week program. And uh, Kristen. Uh, uh, being the awesome universal servant she is will most likely put a link in there for you but do learn about that it starts February 4 I believe uh, and uh, it's an awesome 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 program got lots of positive comments on it <clears throat> so uh, Kathy Arnold says she's so very hot thank you so much um, Wow there's uh, well wow, thank you there's pain to I don't know what that means. Um, oh, thank you, Monica. Says you need to join that program. And thank you, Vanessa. So some of the students are are, are uh, consistent uh, watchers of the live streams now. So um, let me see what else to finish with here. Oh, I wanted to let everybody know. Uh, especially for those that are new and thank you Kristen for posting the Awaken Spiritual Channels program and the links in her chat box that um, the brain can inhibit us in so many ways it it can literally bring debilitation to our life because the brain and the heart collectively are directly related to a, a great deal over 50% of our uh, emotional mental blockages over 50% of the clarity of our pathway in life um, the choices that we make in and out sometimes we're unable to make choices sometimes we feel lost and circling brain and heart very related to these blockages you can receive uh, very high level blessings or middle level blessings middle level blessings like a crown chakra blessing for intelligence or a crown chakra blessing for improving memory um, they're only a hundred I've given the, the higher level transmissions the healing and transmission systems which are 300 and it's reversed people's brains epileptic conditions and stroke conditions um, again all credit to Master Shah and to Creator because they're the ones doing the work but um, that's the power of the even higher level blessings so if you or your children have intelligence related blockages um, or, or, or uh, significant mental emotional blockages please check in with me help me uh, allow me to explain to you in greater detail how that can serve you yeah it's a it's a it's a hundred or, or more dollars but it will save your life and make your life a whole lot happier so learn more that way again tell people about the awakened spiritual channels program if um, you know of anybody that's interested and I will be back tomorrow and uh, I will serve you more at that point in time. So thank you, Divine Dao Source. Thank you, all the beings of light. Thank you, all of those that came to serve today. And thank to all of you. All souls respectfully return. Gong song, gong song, gong song. We'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye, everybody.